What up, Lotto Squad? Hashtag Tater Gang. We're Tater coming at you. Middle of the week. Wednesday, hump day. And as I said, I'll bring you that new rundown workout. Here we go. I'm going to start like this. All right, let's go over here. All right, what do we got? So you take your last hit, right? Last number that fell. We're going to start right here. So we'll go with six, eight, seven, right? So that was, say that was yesterday's hit, right? Now you start right here. You're going to go seven, four, three, okay? We're going to add it down, you know. So seven plus six is 13. 7 plus 3 is 10, plus 7 is 17, plus 7 again, 14, plus 7 again, 11, 21 I mean. I just, don't even count the first digit, just count the second digit. It's easier that way in your head. Plus 7 is 8, plus 7 again is 15, plus 7 is 2, plus 7 is 9, and plus 7 is 6. So it repeats your six, just like any other rundown workout that you've done. Eight plus four is 12. <clears throat> plus another four, 16. Six plus four is 10. Plus four is four. Plus four, eight, 12, 16, 20, plus four, Plus four, eight. Now seven plus three, ten. Ten plus three, thirteen. Is e six, nine, twelve. Keep adding three all the way down, right? Fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, four, seven. All right. Now the next hit that came after that six, eight, seven was 741, right? You see the 741 anywhere. Pow. Okay. After the 741, let's see what fell after that. The evening was 789 on the 10th. Can you find that? Can you find the 789? Well, Tater, how am I supposed to find all that? Well, you got, you're going to have to figure out where your state's going. You're going to have to learn your hit sums because a lot of hit sums will bring, say, the mirror hit sum or the next hit sum right above it. A five might bring a six or a zero. You never know. you got to figure that out, not me. I'm showing you how the numbers are going to keep coming out of this, and then I'm going to show you what to do when they don't. That's when... You start, Paul, with the next number that doesn't show. That's when you start your new rundown with the 743. So anyhow, so after where we at, the 789 on the 10th foul, what came next? The 063. Come over to our workout here. Now as you start to see, day was bringing day. This was the midday of the day before. The midday the next day came right off of that. Straight nonetheless. Both of those were straight. So was that. 789. All these were straight hits. 603 or 063 is on here multiple times. I don't highlight it every time because I don't want it to confuse me and start jamming me up. But you can, however, if you want. It's up to you. Do the zero however many times it came, alright? Alright. What came after 063 that night? It came 856. Lo and behold, where do you see 856? Right there, 856. It came in between the midday and evening from the day before, right? Right, there's the 856. All right, moving along. What came after 856 next midday? 504. 504. Let's see, is it on there? Sure is. And it's exact, too, again, right? Four. Also, diagonal right here, too. 504, okay? All right, now where do we go? 
So the next hit that night was 329. We got the 329 on here anywhere. Technically, if you're using your mirrors, you do because right here, you know, this would be a three. Your eight is mirrored to a three. That'd be 392, but we're not going to count it like that. I want this exact number two be there, so I don't want to have to decipher mirrors. So what do I do? Pal, that starts my next workout. When the 329 isn't on there, I do my next rundown again. So I rock the same rundown until it doesn't show the winning number again. So let's go down. Let's see. So 7 plus 3 again is, we already know that, 10. 7 plus 0, 7. Come on, focus. Plus 7. Sorry, I'm trying to get the focus here. 7 plus 7 is 14. All right, there we go. 7 plus 4 is 1. Plus 7 again is 8, 5, 2, 9, 6, 3. All right, 4 plus 2 is 6. 6 plus 4 is 10. Plus 4, plus 4. Plus four, plus four. Two. All right, nine plus three is twelve. Plus three, fifteen. Plus three, eighteen. Plus three, one. Plus three, four, seven, ten. Three, six. Nine. All right, so what came after the 329? The next day was 780. Come back down over here. Do we have the 780? Yes, it, it, this time it's not exact. However, it's there though. 708. Was just like that. All right, after the 780, what did we have? We had 240. Look at that. Now they're starting to go right by each other like the normal 962 would. 204 or 402 right diagonal right there, right? I mean, it's on there again multiple times, but we're not going to do it. I don't want to cloud it all up. You can. I mean, to me, it kind of clouds it up. So, all right. What happened after the 204? Look at that. That 603 came right back haunt, to haunt me. But... It's on there again multiple times. It's like you shouldn't have missed it. Hated. So we got it right up here. Six zero three. It's over here again. Six zero three. I'm not gonna highlight again, like I said, because it's gonna just keep muddying up the waters. But you might want to because if you notice them start pulling from that area, keep pounding it, that's gonna draw your attention to it. Right? Right. So every now and again, I double back here, you know, to see, okay, was it still in there again, you know? All righty. All right. Let's see. So here we go. What came after the 603? 557. Is 557 on there? Let's see. I mean, it could be, again, like I said, if you want to use your mirrors, 507, that'd be your 5. But I don't want to do that, so that's where, again, triggers my new rundown. So that pulled off 1, 2, 3 hits, whereas this one had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 off that. So that's 8 hits off the two rundowns in the same week. Next, so 557 was the 1. And you just go on. So like I said, the only time I don't use the same rundown is if the numbers ain't there. Then I start a new one. Start a new one. Get it? Got it? Good. Stay tuned, loud squad, because I got one more new workout for you. It's a little twist to the 962 method. All right. If you can't take it any other way, take it easy. I'll catch you guys on the next one.